If you enabled automatically submit when time expires on your quizzes in Angel, you'll need to change the settings once they are converted to Desire to Learn. By default, quizzes will convert uh, quizzes that are converted will be set to allow normal submissions and Desire to Learn. So again, let me show you what I'm talking about here. In my Angel course here, in the Angel course, I have a Unit 1 test. I'm going to go to the settings on Unit 1 test in the Interaction tab. And you'll notice that there is a time limit and a time warning, and it is set automatically to submit um, when time expires. I'm going to go ahead into my Angel, I'm sorry, Desire to Learn course. And when I get into the Desire to Learn course and I get into the course, I'm going to go click on this Assessments and go to Quizzes. So one of the things in Desire to Learn is all your quizzes are in, can be in, are in one spot, but can also be within the modules themselves. So there is a Unit 1 test. I'm going to go ahead on the Action menu and click Edit. I'm going to go ahead and click on proper, I'm sorry, on Restrictions, the Restrictions tab. And I'm going to scroll down. One thing you'll notice is the time limit that was set here, 65 minutes, does come across, so that's very nice. And the grace period comes across too. And this is enforced, meaning that it is uh, it has a time limit. What happens is the late submission here says allow normal submission. You need to change that to auto submit attempt. And then you go ahead and save and close that. Um, and of course, there's going to be an invalid date. So for now, I would just uncheck those dates and just click save and close because you can set those dates at another time when you're ready to get your rest of your course set up. So you have to do that on any of the quizzes that you know um, have, um, have an automatically submit assessments when time expires. Again, you need to change them in Desire to Learn to um, auto-submit.